and welcome to the UK Top 40, the first and only show on television to reveal the brand new chart live and as it happens. Yes. It doesn't end there. We shall also show you the official UK number one before anyone else, may I add. But we are going to begin tonight's countdown with the first climber on our chart. Yep, we found them at number 30. It's the Sugar Babes with two lost in you. Hey, come on, come on, come on. Because it's time for our first chosen new entry at number 21. These are the Bon Bondies with us. Come on, come on. Sunday saw Katie Meller hold on to the top spot for a second week in the album chart. Has she made it three in a row tonight? It's time to find out as we count down this week's album chart top ten. Number one in the album chart and a climate of ten places. That's ten places, no less, on the singles chart. Katie Meller with the closest thing to crazy from the album Call Off the Search. Franz Ferdinand and Take Me Out. And did you know Archduke Franz Ferdinand's assassination started World War One? So there's a bit of history for all you viewers. Now, Chris, he says Franz Ferdinand should be in the top ten. And if they're not, everyone is mad. OK, it's coming up to 6.25, so more or less half an hour before we find out who is at number one. We are just outside the top ten here at the UK Top 40. And we move to the daddy and daughter duo who have climbed three places to number 11. Yes, it's Ozzy and Kelly with changes. Direction for Ozzy and Kelly Osbourne tonight after falling to six to number 14 last Sunday. This week they've climbed three to number 11. And right now there will be some very nervous pop stars sat watching at home as we enter the top 10. So let's get on with it. And first up, sliding three places to number 10. Tonight, Sean Paul and Sasha there with I'm Still Loving In Love With You. I'm Still In Love With You. I'm Still In Love With You. Yeah, 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 yeah. Gotta go that way. Um, I think playing Ozzy and Kelly has got you talking. Louise says, so glad Ozzy and Kelly are still high in the charts. They should collaborate more often. And uh, hi, Connie and H. I think the Brit Awards should go to Mystique, Blazing Squad, Will Young and Black Eyed Peas. They're all great, but Kelly and Ozzy are the best, says Ellie in Leeds. See what okay. I mean? Okay. I'm talking. But it's back to the countdown now. And falling three places, we have... Number seven, that was two play with So Confused. And if you like that, look out for the lead singer, Ragav's debut solo single, Can't Get Enough, which is out in two weeks. Oh, love it. Love that song so much. It has enjoyed an amazing chart life. That's 13 weeks. That's more than three months, did you know? It's outsold many a fly by night. Number one, that was Outcast Hey Ya, climbing to its highest chart position of number three. It's currently the most played song on TV and radio. And so we're down to our final two songs. And after four weeks at number two, has Khalees managed to grab the top spot? Or has LMC versus U2 managed mm. to hold on? Mm. Well, her milkshake does bring all the boys to the yard, doesn't it? Yes, I'm I've heard that. try that strategy. And Tom Import. My milkshake brings all the boys to the yard. Shall we, yeah, shall we have a look? Let's see who is at number two. Then it's like all gelatinous and wobbly. You, you were at top of the pops, weren't you? Yes. He he job, but he was a great performer, I have to say. So could one of those be topping our chart next week? Make sure you join us at 6 o'clock to find out here first. Yep, and don't forget you can chat more about tonight's chart by logging on to our website, bbc.co.uk forward slash cbbc. But right now, here is Radio 1's words with this week's official UK number one. We will see you. Bye. Bye.